Hey. Hey. You remember me? Yeah, I do. <laughs> okay. Um, I have uh, two questions for you, if that's okay with you. Uh, my first question is this. Um, do you ever wonder what became of Shockwave after the whole Predacons Rising thing ended in uh, Transformers Prime? Well, I hope he's sitting in the mind of some producer somewhere so they can bring him back. Uh, hmm. And I don't mean to be rhetorical. Because I really, I really take things in the moment. Like when I do a character that's been known from before, I don't even go back and listen to anybody, uh, any other version of it on purpose so that I could just keep him right in front of me like he would be in life. And you know, I left him where I left him and I hope they bring him back and we could just continue on or start in a new place. Mm -hmm. and, well, if that, and if that was the only time I ever get to play him, it was a great experience. Okay. And that could very well happen because if enough years pass, different producers come along that don't know you and they'll just, they'll just cast somebody else and that's okay. Well, too bad they didn't bring him back for Transformers Robots in Disguise. They talked about it but it never happened. Unfortunately. And I have a second question, if this should surprise you. Um, uh, would uh, Alita still kick your butt even if you're not a centurion? <laughs> Alita? Yes. Um, well, she, Alita doesn't really listen to the centurion. It's a whole other thing. Alita Battle Angel he's talking about. Um, and I played the Centurion, uh, all of them. <laughs> they were all kind of like RoboCop, but mean version of RoboCop. And um, or Ed she, 209. she wouldn't be listening to any of them. Oh. She'd Not do whatever she to wanted. Cyborgs who sound like you. Well, I think it was probably a pre-recorded thing that they just threw in all the cyborgs. I don't really know that he really had even a personality. It was just a, a programmed thing. I didn't really. That was the one character I've ever played where I really didn't think it was really a character. It was like a, a pre-recording thing. You know, they, they would program them to do different things. It was so robot, robotic that there wasn't much human element to him at all, oh. in my opinion. Oh. Well, thank you. You bet. Alita rules. <laughs>